guys, I'm Paul Denton. I want to welcome you aboard a 2021 64 Galleon. Well, it's been a while since I was a yacht captain, so a little rusty on loading the ski. But we're starting on the swim platform, which is a hydraulic swim platform, integrated steps with fresh water wash down and access into the crew. As you can tell, plenty of space for us and the ski to still enjoy the space. Starting up on the flybridge, this beautiful galleon, immediately you can appreciate the massive flybridge space. Plenty of entertainment on the aft deck, midship, and all the way up to the bow. One of the great features of the aft deck of this flybridge is the option to convert this table to seat either eight with a big party or just for cocktail hour. Moving forward on the flybridge, we have a great wet bar equipped with a few amenities with a sink, a nice ice maker, little refrigerator and grill. Moving forward on the flybridge, coming up to the bow, we have a great conversion here, so you could socialize either facing aft or forward with the bunny pad. At the flybridge helm station, we have a single plotter. We got our engine controls, autopilot, one of my favorite features, a yacht controller, which allows you to control the boat anywhere around the vessel, bow, stern, main deck, flybridge, you choose, you control. This galleon is loaded with features. Another one I'd love to mention is the sunshade, which allows you to either take in the sunlight while sitting at the main helm or cover it up because you've had enough sun for the day. Coming down from the flybridge into the main aft deck, we have a great C-section seating. I want to touch on a couple of amenities that are here that are offered on this aft deck. One being a privacy shade that drops down. Another being a television that pulls all the way up allowing the C-section seating to watch their favorite football game. Engine room access, great storage midship for all your life jackets, toys. Also, look at the space that we can take advantage of here with these wings down. So before continuing on the starboard side, I wanted to showcase this pocket door for a safety feature going onto the swim platform. The Polish really had a great design and engineering when thinking about building this boat. Continuing exterior main deck, you can see what this space has to offer when the wing is down. Starboard side has now two bar stools that it offers, sistered up on the port side, which we'll see shortly. First things first, we are in the Bahamas and look at this view. Um, up on the bow, we have a few features to discuss here. The tables are able to go flush mount with the seating. The backrests are able to fold and stow. And the seats are actually able to come out forward to give you a more entertainment space up here on the bow. Walking down the port side, you can see the wing station is sistered up just like the starboard side. Dual bar seats, this one gives you direct access into the galley. Another feature I want to touch base on is the glass that'll let you see straight to the water. Imagine the underwater lights on here, just getting a great ambiance and great entertainment. All right, so now I get to bring you interior. Once again, no lack of features interior on this boat. Starting off in the galley, we pass a full fridge and freezer, a dishwasher, we also have a sink, convectional oven, stove top, wine fridge. Check out the space that you get to utilize from both sides of the bar here. Continuing forward midship, we are passing the companionway into the staterooms, passing a television that lifts up and down for this great C-section seating with a table that goes up and down, allowing more cushions to be added and just utilizing the most of this space. 
Now all the way to the bow on the main deck, to the main deck helm station, we have dual plotters, bow, stern, thruster. We have a autopilot control, our engine controls, sea keeper control. Also one of my favorite hidden gems of this boat is a little fridge and cocktail bar that you can utilize when coming in and out of the bow entry. Heading down to the staterooms located midship starboard side, first thing we pass is a day head. This day head will be dual access purpose for the twin stateroom, which is forward of the master. Walking back midship to the master stateroom, which is a full beam, offers a nice settee, obviously great ambient lighting, and an ensuite with a walk-in shower. Located on the bow of this vessel, all the way forward, lower deck, we'll find the VIP. The VIP is equipped with its own entertainment space, an ensuite, also with a walk-in shower. On behalf of Dennis and Yachty and myself, Paul Denton, I want to thank you for joining us on this walkthrough aboard the 64 2021 Galleon. I look forward to seeing you on the docks.